Hi everybody, it's Dan and welcome back. Today we are diving right back into Zelda Breath of the Wild on Master Mode. Alright, I'm like super excited. I've been searching YouTube to watch other people play in Master Mode. Can never find it. So, you know what? I was like, I'm gonna do it. Why not? Can't wait. Pretty much the only reason why I bought a Nintendo Switch. Breath of the Wild. There it is. Ah, gets me every time. So good. Already got chills. Let's do it. I'm ready. Let's take on Ganon right out of the gate. Open your eyes. Oh, I forgot how gorgeous this game was. Wake up, Link. And I mean, you know. Go, let's do it. Come on. Ready to play. And here we go. Right, let's see if I remember how to at least attack. Okay, well we can't do anything yet. That is a Sheikah Slate. Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. that sound. Sheikah Slate, a mysterious tablet with a glowing center. You've never seen this device before, and yet there's something familiar about it. <clears throat> and off we go. First chest of the game. Well-worn trousers. These old trousers are threadbare in spots, but they're surprisingly comfortable. The legs are a bit too short though, and it can never be too short. Open inventory. All right, I think I remember this. Now we have pants. And what was this? Was this a shirt? Old shirt. A thin shirt made long ago. It's coming apart at the seams, but it's better than nothing. The sleeves are a bit on the short side. And let's put on our shirt. And out to the wild. Oh, gotta open the door. Hold the Sheikah Slate up to the pedestal. That will show you the way. Authenticating. Sheikah Slate confirmed. Ooh, I'm so excited. Link, you are the light, our light. That must shine upon Hyrule once again. 
Now go. And we're off. Oh, that's the run button. Okay. And jump. I'll never get the first time I play this game. This was honestly, I think, my favorite part. Great plateau. Tree branch. Wooden branches such as this are pretty common, but it's surprisingly well balanced. Doesn't do much damage, but can serve as a weapon in a pinch. Use weapon. Attach with your equipped weapon. Ha! Okay. Shall we get some mushrooms? Now remember where some things are, but not entirely. Definitely not the Korok seed. Oh. Uh, I know there's supposed to be different things about Master Mood, but I don't remember what. Are there different weapons? Different monsters? Uh, something sparkly? What is that? Tree branch. Hallian yeah, mushrooms. Push a boulder. Let's see where that goes. Hi. Almost hit boss man. All right. I don't see anything new. No different monsters or anything. Uh. Wasn't there an apple? There it is. Apple. Apple. A common fruit found on trees all around Hyrule. Eat fresh or cook it to increase its effect. And let's climb that tree and get that apple. Thank you. And let's take a baked apple. Direct heat has softened and sweetened this apple. Eat it to restore three quarters of a heart. I beg your pardon. I do believe that is my baked apple. You can't just go about taking whatever you please. <laughs> oi hoy, forgive me. <laughs> oi hoy, oh ho. <laughs> Forgive me, I could not resist pulling your leg. Please help yourself. An apple and an open flame make for a succulent treat. It is a bit strange to see another soul in these parts. Uh, who are you? Hmm. Me? I'll spare you my life story. I'm just an old fool who has lived here alone for quite some time now. What brings a bright-eyed young man like you to a place like this? Where are we? Hmm. Answering a question with a question, that's fair enough. As I cannot imagine our meeting to be a simple coincidence, I shall tell you. This is the Great Plateau. According to legend, this is the birthplace of the entire Kingdom of Hyrule. Alright, give us the history. Hmm. That temple there, long ago, it was the site of many sacred ceremonies. Like from the Ocarina of Time. Ever since that decline of the kingdom a hundred years ago, it has sat abandoned in a state of decay. <sighs> Yet another forgotten entity, a mere ghost of its former self. What? Wait, is that it? I thought there was more, more chatty chat, more coffee. <laughs> Ahoy! Oh, oops. I shall be here for some time. Please let me know if I may be of service. Okay. We will just go explore. Torch. This torch will stay lit once ignited, but if you put it away, the flame will be extinguished until you light it again. Change weapon. Okay. Hmm? Well then, just help yourself to that torch there. And how am I asked are you planning to use it uh, as a weapon? Hmm. Innovative. However, that is probably best used to light fires. If you need a weapon, you can find something better. Many beasts roam the land past this point, 
You can take my axe with you, if you please, assuming you can find it. Uh -huh. However, do not just swing it around without purpose. You must face your opponent and lock your sights on them. Okay. Did not know that was part of the dialogue. And there is your axe. Okay, so that's how you lock on. And I do remember there's a Korok C over there, though. Woodcutter's axe. A woodcutter's tool of choice for falling trees. Felling trees. Its formidable weight and uneven balancing make it slow, inefficient weapon. Okay. Uh, shall we go get that Korok seed? First one of the game. Don't remember if I can make it up. Oh, no, 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 no. There it is. Okay. Let's give a little, little run. Oh. I gotta pay attention to that stand. Oh, right. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, no. Is this new? Link. Ooh. Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. Okay. Alright, where was I? Alright, so let's dive in. You found me. Huh? You're not Hestu. But you can. See me? I didn't know your kind could see the children of the forest. Well, if you aren't a Hestu, please return this to him. Korok seed. The small seed was given to you by a Korok. It has discarded... Oh, it has a distinct smell. If you gather a bunch of them, you might never... You never know... Ooh, can't talk. <laughs> you never know what might... Ooh, what may happen. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places, too. Don't be shy about poking your nose into suspicious places. Alrighty, then. I forget how many of them there were. I think there was, like, three, four hundred? I don't know if we're going to be able to find all of them. Uh, but I do have the DLC. And there is that fancy little Korok mask that makes a noise when you're nearby. Rusty broadsword. Bro, no, go, go. <laughs> broadsword. This once fearsome sword has seen better days. It could do some damage in the right hands, but also breaks quickly. Okay, and the release. Got it. All right, shall we go to the Temple of Time? Uh, what's the quickest way to get there without dying? That is for a bomb. Uh, all right. Let's take a little, little dash and then a break on the mountain, on the mountain, the island. And go this way. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Go, 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 go. Oh, great. Right. Just in case we have any... Oh, no, don't do that. Cancel. Okay. Okay. Now, are there going to be any monsters around here? Oh, I heard it. Where is it? Oh, okay, hello. Boom, okay. Let's get another tree branch. Oh. Why did these get so... Just oh, thank you. Choo-choo jelly. A gelatinous substance that can, came from a choo-choo. It's unusable in this state, but applying a bit of elemental situation, stimulation, will change its form. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and do that then. Because I feel like I'm going to need it. Oh! 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 Cheeky! <laughs> There you go. Take the swords. Oh, you're not dead. Yet. Oh, no, 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 no. Where are those apples? Apple, apple, apple. Okay. Uh, we got most of these. So. Okay, we can really use a shield. Get up. Oh! Wait, oh, no. They're. Oh. 
Restores. Oh, I forgot all about that. Okay. So we're gonna have to be like quick. Oh no 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 no. Just die. I do not remember them being this hard. I'm gonna run out of weapons. Oh my gosh. Hit him before his health. Oh no. Oh, we're not gonna make this one. Feel it. There you go. One more should do it. Oh. Just gonna have to whack him in the water. Oh. There we go. Wow. Chasing him all around. Bokoblin. Bokoblin. <laughs> Horn. The severed horn of a goblin, a creature often encountered on the plains of Hyrule. It isn't edible, but it can be tossed into a stew with some critters to make an elixir. A goblin fang. A tooth obtained from a goblin. It's worn down and not very sharp, but it's still pretty hard. Cook it alongside a critter to make an elixir. I actually don't think I've made any elixirs when I was playing on just regular mode. So maybe we'll give that a go. Here in master mode. Not in gloss where I was. Uh that's right. We were going up to the guardian already. Hmm. Okay. Uh let's run to no put your weapon away, Link. Let's run to the fire and throw these choo-choo in. Oh, come on. Take a breath. Alright, let's get back to the fire. We're gonna pick up this rock. Yeah. Hightail Lizard, a lizard found throughout Hyrule. It's a bit slow to react at times, but if given a chance to escape, it will dart off quickly. Cook it with monster parts for a speed-boosting elixir. Perfect. Is there another one under here? No. Okay. Um, I need your fire, sir. Oh boy. Alright. Uh, hold both of them. There we go. Now they're fire choo-choo. Red choo-choo jelly. A jiggly substance that normally comes from a fire choo-choo. It consistently gives off heat. If struck, it will explode in a ball of flame. Perfect. Okay. Now. Was that an apple? There. Oh, 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 oh. A little jump. 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 Oh, why can't I do this? There we go. Okay. Were these the ones I just picked up? Yes. Uh, okay. Let's go see what kind of danger. I feel like some of these guardians might be alive, but... I don't want to run into any surprises. Are you away? Oh, you saw me already. How? Okay. You know what? We're gonna... Why target the goblin? There we go. Come on. I'm gonna get that club out of his hand. Oh, no, no, no. Hit him. Hit him. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Knock the club out. Oh, did you drop it? Oh, this is so much harder. Okay, come on. Oh, no, no. Oh, I died already. That is just horrible. Okay, okay. Ooh, it was just a warm up. Yes, continue. Okay. Uh, let's maybe get a couple more quicker weapons if we can. Did that give us any tree branches? No. But it did give us wood. <laughs> uh, are there any sneaky chests here? Because I feel like with the DLC, the 
EX chest should be around here, right? Roasted bird drumstick. Raw bird drumstick that's been cooked to a crisp, skin and all. It's devoid of seasoning, but it has a simple, accessible taste. Restores more hearts than the raw variety. We will need that. Uh, okay, where did that... There you are. Do I have any... No better. Oh, my fire choo-choo. Oh, that's right. We'll do that later. Um, I guess we can just start with the torch and just whack our way that way. Just quickly die. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um... Let's do my drumstick. And we need a weapon. No! Okay. Forgot how to dodge. But we should do Oh no! I'm gonna die, aren't I? Okay. Uh let's just how through. Oh, didn't do it. Okay. Get up, Link. Come on. Give him a couple good whack. Oh! Why is this one Bacoblin giving me so much trouble? Oi. Okay, you know what? We're gonna skip him. Maybe come back. Hmm. I don't know. We'll just go around. Let's just go around. Uh, let's see. Uh, or, you know what? Let's just do what Zelda said and make our way to the dot on the map. Let's just do that. Uh, I don't see any chests. Affect her weapons. <clears throat> Okay, uh, I see another bad guy there. Uh, hopefully this will work. I know this worked in regular mode. Uh, we can kill them like super quick. I don't know. Oh, can I not push you? Oi, okay. Okay, one dead. Oh, you saw me. Okay. Uh, Okay, you know what? No. Let's just go here. Oh, he's like right there. Okay. Uh, Bacoblin Guts. A rare material obtained by defeating a Bacoblin. It convulses on its own every now and then, which is really creepy. But perhaps it has a use. Okay, run away. Run. Run, run, run. Oh, no. Not a good time to run out of stamina, Nick. Oh, there we go. Okay. We got the dodge. Come on. <sighs> Maybe we'll just avoid all of them for now. Yeah, I think that'll be a good idea. It's dangerous to approach enemies head on when you're low on hearts. Yeah, we are totally learning that. All right, let's uh, avoid all of that and let's just safely get to where Zelda wanted us to go to. Just avoid all the Bacoblins. Don't still don't see any chests or anything new. Oh, can I maybe get weapons down here? Watch me die. I'm so gonna die again. Oh, yeah. okay. Um. Oh, I thought he was about to whistle. Okay. Whew. Can I crouch? There we go. Okay. Nice and quiet. I can just get these better weapons. Am I 
nice and slow. Boko Club. A crude but cobbling club made to carve a small prey. It's essentially a stick, so its durability is well. Great. All right, seared steak. Raw meat cooked over an open flame. Cooking it has increased its flavor and the number of hearts it provides. Okay, run away, run away, run away. Oh, they're about to throw rocks. And barrels, okay, no thank you. Let's just run up here, get away please. Go away, thank you. Look, I've disappeared, don't come up here. Oh gosh, he's coming up here, okay. Uh. Nope, wrong way, wrong way. Oh, I thought I died already. Really? Can I just kill one? That's all I want to do is just kill one. Oh, I'm getting nervous. Okay. Let's uh, eat an apple or two. That's about to break. Where'd you go? Did he die? Oh, yeah, finally. Okay. Okay. Good, good, good. Where's the other one? He is dancing. You know what? We're just going to leave him be. I'm not going to press the luck. And, oh, no thank you. Don't blow any horns. Oh, you saw me, didn't you? Oh my gosh. Please leave me alone. Just leave me be. How can I get over without dealing with them? It's like right there. Okay, we got this. We got this. Uh, should we just dash for it? I know you're gonna be tricky, but you do have a sword. And if I can just get that. Okay, we're going. He dropped his shield, he dropped his shield, okay. Look, go shield. A bacobbling made shield created by attaching a handful, a handhold to any flat tree bark picked up off the ground. It's pretty shoddy, so don't expect it to last very long, okay. Raise your shield. Do I have it equipped? I do. Oh, there we go. Okay. Can this do it? Glory rush. Come on. I feel like I didn't do anything. I just want the sword. Just give me the sword. See in the grass. Okay. Just drop your sword. That's all you gotta do. I'm not gonna make it. And I have no weapons. Okay, we're gonna run away. We are just gonna run away. What is that over there? Oh my gosh, no, 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 leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Come on, go away. We're cool, we're cool, we're cool. Alright. Yeah, what is that? Are those... A little Air Force in Hyrule, look at that. That is just awesome. Okay, we're gonna have to... We're gonna figure out how to deal with those. Let's, let's raise this so we can start getting some... Sheikah Slate Powers. Examine. Place the Sheikah Slate on the pedestal. Yeah, take a little cheeky look around. Sheikah Tower activated. Please watch for falling rocks. Oh, this is going to be so cool. Love this part.
Little stumble. Great Plateau Tower. Distilling local information. There it is, the Great Plateau. Regional map extracted. to uh, but I need to get off the plateau first but maybe we can give it a try complete all right moving along there we go that's just such a great view uh twin peaks I do remember that uh mount not mount doom is it mount doom uh oh why can't I think of the mountain Ah, there's Meadow. Hello. I'm going to get on you pretty soon. Because that's going to make everything so much easier. Okay. Uh, we need to get down. So, let's... Oh, oh. Almost fell off the hole. But I know where to go, go. Oh, this is going to make me so dizzy, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. Okay. Oh, get down, Blake. There we go. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh wow. Oh. Okay, let's just jump oh! in. Hello, who's this? Oh, that's right. My mites. Seems we have quite the enigma here. What's that? This tower and others just like it have erupted across the land one after another. It is almost as though a long, dormant power has awoke quite suddenly. If you don't mind me asking, did anything odd occur while you were on top of that tower? I heard a voice. <sighs> well now, a voice, you say. And did you happen to recognize this voice? Uh, no, but I did. Link did not, so we'll say no. Mm. I see. Well, that is unfortunate. I assume you... Caught sight of that atrocity is shrouding the castle. Hmm. That is Calamity Ganon. 100 years ago, that vile entity brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin. It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its path. So many innocent lives were lost in its wake. For a century, the very symbol of our kingdom, Hyrule Castle, has managed to contain that evil, but just barely. There it festers, building its strength for the moment it will unleash its blight upon the land once more. It would appear that moment is fast approaching. Oh. I must ask you, courageous one, do you tend to make your way to the castle? I sure do. 
I had a feeling you would say that. Here on the isolated plateau, we are surrounded on all sides by steep cliffs with no way down. If you were to try to jump off, well, no death could be more certain or more foolish. Hmm. Of course, if you had a paraglider like mine, that would be quite another story. Oh, that's right. Is this where he starts being a little cheeky with a little quest? Yes, hand it over. <laughs> Ahoy! Certainly, why not? But there is no such thing as a re item in this world, you know. Hmm. Let's see now. How about I trade you for a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby? The isolated plateau. Open adventure lock. Hmm. Come, let me show you something. Alright, you're gonna walk super slow. And I also have like no weapons, do I? Oh, I have my torch. Okay. We have a torch. Perfect. Do you see that structure there? The one shining with strange light? Began glowing at the exact moment those towers rose up from the ground. Okay. <laughs> I would think such a place might house some sort of treasure, wouldn't you? Treasure for a paraglider? A fair exchange, I believe. I would think so. But I think that is, you know, I think that's where we're gonna end it today. Just no, 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 no. We gotta at least do one try, one try. So let's make our way. Oh, can I get a butterfly? No. I feel like there should be EX chest around here just cause the, oh, just cause of the DLC. Oh gosh, oh, look at that. Okay. Oh, fire arrows, arrows. Oh, but if I can knock him in the water, I could totally get those. Uh, okay, you know what? We're gonna wait, we're gonna wait. Ooh. Ancient spring. A spring used in ancient machinery. It is light and buoyant enough to float on water. No matter how many times it's compressed, it never loses tension. We're gonna need lots of those because we need to stock up on that ancient armor gear. Uh, Alright, let's get to the shrine. Yeah, I feel like those EX chests should be somewhere. Is this a Korok seed? No, I don't think so. Is this a Korok seed? No. Okay, oh, is this the Magnesis one? Perfect. Alright, let's, let's just go ahead and get this chest. Oh, okay. Two chests. Maybe one of those would be the EX one. Uh, does that say EX? No. Okay. Oh my- Ooh, here we go. Okay. I knew they should be in here. Maybe it would be an awesome weapon. A ruby. A precious red gem mined from large ore deposits found throughout Hyrule. Rubies contain the power of fire and have fetched a high price since ancient times. Alright, that's how we're gonna buy our house. Sheikah Slate confirmed. Just love the blue and orange color. Travel gate registered to map. Yay! Love a good fast travel. Access granted. Let's make our way down. Bottomless bog, quagmire that'll draw you in, sink in too deeply, and you'll be unable to escape. I don't think I ran into those ever in my normal time. Alright, to so you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Amar U. In the name of the goddess of Hylia, I offer you this trial. Magnesis trial. Okay, let's get some Magnesis. Get this game rolling. Salmon. Shika Slate authenticated. Distilling room. Hm. 
Magnesis. Manipulate metal metallic objects using magnetism. Grab onto metallic objects using the magnetic energy that pours forth from the magnesis room. Objects held in the magnetic snare can be lifted up and moved freely. All right. Well, let's do it. Use room. Okay. I'm so good it still has the what the controls are because I totally would have forgotten. Uh, activate. Lift you up. Okay. Drop you. Thank you. I have new weapons just in case. Alright. I think there was what? There was a little tiny baby guardian in here. Right? I think so. Up. Thank you. Uh, let's just give it a little push. Uh, that's right. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's take you. There you are. Okay. How far can I go? Can I hit him? So close, okay. Now come through. Oh, he sees me. Okay. I'm just gonna push you through. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, 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 don't die. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, gosh. Okay, no weapons. And two, two mushrooms. Okay, so you know what? We're... You can't get me up here. But, I... oh, your health goes up. Oh my gosh. Alright, so we're gonna press A. We're gonna have to throw you in the water somehow and just kill you quickly. Do you die in the water? I forget. I know the Bacoblins do. Let's find out. Oh, well, that works too. Okay, perfect. Let's go up. See, gotta be very innovative. No weapons. Ancient spray and an ancient screw. Screw used in ancient machinery. It's made of an unknown material, and no matter how many times it's turned, its threads never seem to show signs of wear. Perfect. Alright, let's put you back. Thank you. Gotta get you back. Do a little loop de loop. Right. And we get a chest. Oh, he's have a weapon. <clears throat> weapon? A bow. Traveler's bow. Small bow used by travelers for protection. It doesn't, oh, protection. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it can be used to attack foes from a distance. Perfect, draw bow, release fire. No bows, okay, more. Hello. Let's go get Amon Ah, Amon U. We get our spirit orb, and be a quarter of the way done with the Great Plateau. Proven to possess the you have proven to possess the resolve of a true hero. I am Amon Ul, the creator of this tribe. <clears throat> I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of goddess Hylia, and dedicated to helping those who seek to defeat Gan. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. Okay. In the name of the goddess Hylia, allow me to bestow this gift upon you. Please accept this spirit. Here we go. <clears throat> 
Spirit Orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the goddess smile upon you. Well, thank you. Okay, one shrine down. We have Magnesis. We've got an EX checks, EX chest, and a ruby, and a bow. So we need arrows, lots oh. of arrows, or a mix of arrows and weapons. Hello. It seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. How did you know? <laughs> Clairvoyant. Ahoy! Or perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it can become quite more difficult to see what is right before your own eyes. Ah. However, that which was once oh, however that which was once hidden from view can often be crystal clear. Perhaps that is not true for everyone. Ahoy ho. Ahoy ho. The appearance of those towers and the awakening of this shrine. Hmm. It is all connected to that Sheikah Slate you carry on your hip there. Uh, I really want that pair of butter. <clears throat> I've yet to finish speaking. Ah, oh, that's right. You're temperamental. All right. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. The great power of their wisdom saved the kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago. Or so it's said. It is interesting, however, to think how something like that survived all this time hidden away in a shrine. Hmm. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places all across the land. On the Sabato alone, I believe there are still three more. <laughs> Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines and I will give you my paraglider. Uh, so I need more now. Hmm. I said treasure, but I never said there would be only be one treasure. Whether it's one treasure or four, what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I will also teach you a trick for finding shrines. Hmm. It's always best to survey the area by looking around from a high point. Let's see here. How about you make your way to the top of that tower again? <laughs> oh ho ho! I'm afraid not, but do not worry. I have another little trick to share with you for your effort. Take a look at the map on your Sheikah Slate, okay? Ooh. See those blue icons? Should Recognize the cave where you woke, the shrine you came from, and the tower. Wait, how I never noticed that before. How does he? He said, the cave where you woke. Did we say that in our last conversation? I feel like we didn't. So maybe there were clues earlier on that he was something more than what he really was. Even though now we know he is more than what he was, but at the time we didn't know that he was. Yeah. You can travel instantly to any of those places with the Sheikah Slate. Hmm. Or so I heard quite some time ago. I don't know if it actually works as such. Alright. Well, I think that is going to do it today. Uh, that Bacoblin <laughs> at the beginning took a little... Took us for a little spin, I will admit. Um, but let's at least get this chest first and then see if it's a weapon. If it's not a weapon, then that will be the first thing we do when we play again. And it's not. It is an amber. A fossilized resin with a caramelesque. Well, that's a fun word to say. It just rolls off a caramelesque sheen to it. It's been valued as a component in decorations and crafting since ancient time. Okay, not a weapon, that is fine. We will focus on getting a weapon next time. And there was another chest though. Wait, I'm sorry. I feel like I've said bye twice now, but let's, let's, let's get the chest. Let's get the chest. Fingers crossed for a weapon. Thank you. A valuable ore that gives off a mesmerizing iridescent iridescence similar to the inside of a seashell. It contains the power of water. All right, I give up. There's no weapons right now in the Great Plateau. Lots of bacoblins and flying octoroks and I think bacoblins. So we're going to have our hands full next time. Thank you for hanging out and enjoying some Breath of the Wild on Master Mode with me. 
if you're a fan of Zelda or Breath of the Wild and you're just ready to play that sequel, give this video a like. It really helps me out. Let's me know I'm playing games you like, you enjoy, and you want to see more of. Plus, speaking of more Zelda, be sure to check out the Breath of the Wild playlist. You'll find that in the link down below in the description, along with all my other social media links. So, give a follow, say hello, how do you do, and let me know how you're getting on during your Zelda Breath of the Wild playthrough. Alrighty, well I will see you all in the next video very very soon. Bye!